Uh, look at Reggie getting out of the ring there. That's a wise thing on his part. That's right. The fans, uh, as we said, the fans are uh, are on the side of Gaza Coleman here, which I believe could be because, uh, as you said, Eddie Osborne has aligned himself with Reggie Marley, and uh, Gaza Coleman Jr. is is and always will be his own man. Whoa! I'm getting shirts thrown at me all over the place here. Well, there's layers and layers of drama and intrigue on this match. This is not just a regular match. This is uh, the, the PWA heavyweight title picture uh, ever since uh, Steve Carino came in here in the summertime and just tore it wide open. Uh, of course, he took the title from uh, Reggie Marley. And, uh, you know, Geza, he fought uh, that incredible series of bouts there with uh, Carino and that now with Impact holding the title. And Geza saying flat out he wants a piece of his ass. Uh, he's in there with uh, Reggie. Obviously, it wouldn't surprise me one bit, actually, if Eddie Osborne put Reggie Marley in there as an obstacle to try and uh, wear down Geza and perhaps eliminate him before he gets to that next step. Absolutely. We've seen uh, we've seen Geza Coleman and Reggie Marley before in uh, wrestling Cambridge and uh, all over the place here for the uh, PWA uh, Heavyweight Championship. And each match has been great, as I'm sure this one will be. Geza Coleman Jr. As you said, Geza Coleman Jr. and Steve Carino uh, locked up in, in, in possibly the, the best matches not only here in the PWA but ever um, in, in Cambridge there, the big uh, half an hour half an hour uh, melee there in uh, in Cambridge. Yeah, a lot of people underestimate Gaza. He's an uh, incredible mad technician. And let's not forget, uh, Wes Reggie's over there getting in the fans' faces now, but uh, I think that's just a show on his part. He's trying to play a mind game. But how do you play a mind game with a guy that uh, loves to compete in mixed martial arts competitions like Gaza? Because uh, he's got that, that entire... Uh, Pit fighting experience behind him. He's uh, he knows how they fight in Brazil, and he knows how they fight inside the UFC octagon. And uh, he's going to take it right to Reggie Marley right now. Absolutely, yeah, Reggie Marley. Reggie Marley is, is very distracted by these fans here, all over the place. But as we said, uh, Gaza is, is is his own man. It doesn't get distracted by anybody on the outside or anybody in the ring. But it looks like they're going to lock up here. Coming out of tie up here by uh, uh, with Reggie Marley and Gaza Coleman. Reggie looks like he's pushing Gaza here into the ropes a little bit. Hung up in the ropes, oh, but Gaza turns him. Now hung up in the corner, Reggie's got him. Oh, ducks that blow there, does Gaza, uh-oh, uh-oh, look out. Look out, Reggie, you don't want it, you don't want these. Those punches of, of by Gaza here, he's gonna knock out Reggie here with these blows. Not good, oh, referee gets in the, uh, gets in the middle of it. Reggie Marley. Almost got knocked out there by uh, the Gaza Coleman Jr. Yeah, you don't want to be trading strikes with Gaza, and uh, you can see a couple of them got through there. Might have rattled Reggie a little bit. And let's not forget, Reggie suffered a concussion not too long back when uh, he took an errant belt shot to the head, and he was uh, taken to the hospital and checked out. And, uh, you know, he's, he's coming back now, but he's got to be careful with them blows to the head because uh, they can really mess you up. So if Gaza's smart, he's going to go right after that head and rattle that noggin and see if that uh, brain's back to the snuff yet. That's right. No, I'm sure nobody would purposely want to get pummeled by those big fists and uh, and the big bolos there of uh, Gaza Coleman, who just able to rip anybody apart. We saw here in Brantford him uh, him rip apart Warhead here, turning his whole face and whole body just right blood red. Same with uh, PD Flex. He ripped him apart with those bolos. Just just everybody he goes against, even Carino, uh, was able to take him out with those uh, with those bolos. Yeah, his uh, his vaunted ground and pound attack and his punches are just are just devastating. And what he did to Warhead to take that title in the first place was uh, as disturbing and as brutal as it was poetic. And uh, yeah, Warhead was a bloody mess, that's for sure. But there, here's some good mat wrestling from Gazer here right now. So yeah, that's right. Reggie uh, Reggie scooped him up there, almost going for a backdrop, uh, or ra rather, Gazer scooped him up, and uh, Reggie turned him over there with that headlock takedown. And now he's got a side, side headlock applied on Gaza Coleman. As you said, this is absolutely uh, just, just going for tackle here. Oh, tie up, uh, tie up here with a hammer lock and a side headlock of his own there. Gaza Coleman has got a counter for, for every move that anybody throws at him. He's got a counter for counters. And now a side headlock applied here by Gaza Coleman here still. Reggie Marley trying to find some. Uh oh, and once again, here comes those big, uh, those big punches. That's right. Well, Gazer, actually, the onus is on Gazer to win this match because uh, he's got everything to lose. If he can't beat Reggie Marley here, then it's conceivable that uh, PWA champion Eddie Osborne could deny him a title shot by saying he didn't come through my number one contender. Whereas Reggie, he's pretty much just got to survive. And although uh, a big win over Gazer would definitely put him back in the picture, I can't see uh, Eddie Osborne giving him a shot anytime soon. Please. That's right. Look at this. Look at this standoff here. Oh, over a hip toss there was Reggie Marley, but Gaza blocks it. Scoops him over here, trying to trying to scoop him himself here. As Gaza come and kicks the leg there. Uh oh, Reggie catches him, not good. Throws that leg down. An arm wrench take over there by Gaza Coleman Jr. And now, now he's uh, popping on the trying to pop that uh, shoulder out. Yeah, there's some nice counter wrestling and uh, some nice reversals and blocks going on here from both these guys. And uh, both these guys are big men, well over 250 pounds. 
and uh, you know they're uh, they're giving some good clean wrestling here but when those hard shots come in they come in good and again uh, Gazes looks like he's picked a body part now and he's gonna start punishing that arm I think that's right yeah absolute classic wrestling here from the big ticket Reggie Marley and from the big dog Gazer to call him two of two of the best not only here in the PWA as I said but two of the best in the world I, uh, I fully respect, uh, the, I mean, you know, you can't respect some of the things that the big, the big ticket Reggie Marley has done, but you got to respect the mat wrestling ability of both of these guys in the ring here. Well, nobody comes into the PWA that isn't qualified to be here, and uh, I mean, let's face it, the best athletes in the world, not just Ontario, not just Canada, but the best athletes in the world compete for the PWA, and uh, PWA's got people coming in from all over the place, and these are the types of individuals they're going to have to get in the ring and face when they get here, and uh, I'm telling you, this here is a main event match on any card anywhere right now, and uh, like I say, the layers and layers of intrigue and uh, backstage drama behind this one, with uh, Eddie Osborne always lurking in the background as the uh, man making the impact with the PWA heavyweight title. Uh, Geza, it's, it's really on him to, to win this match right here. He's got to get out of this predicament. Yeah, look at the, the, the face of determination of uh, Geza Coleman Jr. here. Trying to wrench on him here, trying to pick himself up. Reggie Marley, Reggie Marley thinks he's got him for good here, has that uh, knee in the back and he's busy distracting the, the secretary here, but oh, getting to his feet is Geza. Front face lock applied by Reggie Marley here, and now uh, blows to the stomach of uh, Geza Coleman here. Oh, look at these, here they come. Oh, blocks that punch, smart move by Reggie Marley, takes him down, whoa, 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 what is this? Oh, Reggie's gonna try, Reggie's, Reggie's trying the, uh, the old Geza here, but oh, kick out there by Geza Coleman, oh, here it comes, here they come, yeah. Here they come. Oh, oh, Reggie getting the feet on the ropes here. Oh, you can hear the way my, my whole voice changes as soon as he gets that, that mount on there, just ready to throw those bobos down on Reggie Marley. There's a big boot. Well, uh, Reggie, he's a smart man. He's, he's always thinking in there, and uh, it was interesting. He tried to turn Gazer's own attack against him, but he knew where he was, and he kept it right near the ropes, and when Gazer rolled over and got control, Reggie was right there to make the break. Hard in the corner goes Gazer, follows them through. Des Re Des Reggie Marley with a big clothesline. Irish whip here again, hard in that corner, and throws another big clothesline. There it is, the big ticket, Reggie Marley, throwing those shoulders into the gut of, uh, of Gaza Coleman here. Throwing him into the corner is, uh, is uh, Reggie Marley. Yeah, and you know, before before Carino, I would have said that Gaza's uh, stamina was suspect because nobody ever lasted for long with him, but uh, he proved he could go 30 minutes in there, and we all know Marley's been in some wars in PWA. He can last, too. This one could go on for a while, or it could be over right away. And uh, Marley, he's definitely trying for it right now. That's right. Here comes. Uh, look at this, the big dog here. Big dog here getting out. Uh, Home blows the back here by Reggie Marley. Secretary not liking that, writing that down. Oh, blows the back here again by Reggie Marley. Got something planned for, for uh, Gaza Coleman here. Oh, going to scoop him up with a big suplex. Looks like it. Big vertical suplex takes him down. And a pin, two, kick out by the big dog, Gaza Coleman Jr. Got to believe it's going to take more than that. Yeah, it's uh, not often Gaza eats a suplex, but uh, this guy's got resiliency coming out of every pore in his body. He just does not know how to give up. Uh, I can't recall Gaza ever submitting. Uh, he's just going to keep coming at you. you got to put him on Strain Street. And a few more right hands like that from Reggie Marty might just do it. But, oh, there's Gaza with the jabs. Yeah, smart move by Gaza. Saw that Reggie was going to block it and started jabbing to the face here. And now he's going to vertically uh, work some strikes here. But Knox Gaza, oh, here he comes. Here they come. Yeah. Oh, here comes those punches, and now the bolos rain it down. Gazer Coleman, Gazer Coleman rain it down those bolos here. Look at this. That's it, Gazer Coleman, knocking out Reggie Marley. Here comes the bolos. You have got to be kidding me. Reggie Marley knocked out from those vicious bolos of Gazer Coleman Jr. I love it. Yeah, just like that, it's uh, the match is over. Reggie Marley, the big ticket, just got introduced to a harsh new reality courtesy of Canada's meanest wrestler, Gazer Coleman Jr., Eddie Osborne.